I'm Kevin Davis. This is my dream team. Uh, in goal, I'm going to go for UC Asik Linen. A true professional, worked so hard, he wanted to be at the top, and he did so for, for a number of years for us. He's an outstanding goalkeeper, so I, I have to put him in there as my goalkeeper. Uh, right back, I'm going to put Jason Dodd in, who I spent some good years with at Southampton. Again, brilliant off the pitch and around the dressing room, but in terms of right back, he was one of those that was underrated a bit. Um, did a fantastic job for us at Southampton. Solid, you know what you're going to get from every week. Uh, Centre-halves, I'm going to put Gary Cale in there because, again, a top pro. Um, starting to see the best of him now, playing alongside John Terry. Uh, great, great lad, brilliant for Bolton. It's good to see him doing so well at Chelsea and gone on to win some, some wonderful trophies. Um, alongside him, I'm going to put John Terry. I just think them two together, it's a fantastic partnership. and had some really good battles with John over the years. Really enjoyed playing against him. Left back, I'm going to go for Ricardo Gardner, he's the most laid back man in football, but again, um, fantastic player, he was loved by everyone at Bolton, he was uh, outstanding, he could play left wing, left back, but um, bundles of ability, pace, um, it's got a good goal made by Munich as well, so I'll put him in there. And then right in midfield, I'm going to go for Ronaldo, I made my debut for, for Bolton, and I think he made his debut for Man United in the, in the same game. Uh, again, best player in the world at the minute. Had an unbelievable career, fantastic player, great professional, and uh, it's just a joy to watch, really. In the middle, I'm going to go for JJ Kocha. I just remember the first few days training against him, he was just running rings around me. I couldn't see where the ball was, he was just laughing, and he was just one of those naturally gifted footballers, amazing, uh, really nice guy. He used to play snooker with him every day after, after, after training. Top bloke, top player. Uh, next to him, I probably, there's so many good players, but I was going to go for Fernando Hierro. We got on loan at Bolton for a few months. Um, again, legend of the game. Uh, won so many trophies, but he was so humble. He was so helpful towards us and a lot of the younger players. And I think in that whole six months he was on loan, I think he gave the ball away once. He was outstanding. Um, so I have to put him in there. I'm on the left of four, go for Matt Letizia because again, I remember going down to Southampton and he was obviously the god down there and uh, he had all the ability to back it up. We had a great relationship, he scored some amazing goals, top bloke, um, one of the best left foot you'll ever see. Um, up front again, play some great strikers along the way. Um, I'd have to put Thierry on me in there. Cause Again, had some great battles against him. Some of the goals he scored, he was just absolutely amazing. Uh, we've got some great strikers in the Premier League at the minute, but he was uh, he was one that just loved playing against and watching. Alongside him, um, again, played with some great strikers. Um, I've, I've, I've put Daniel Sturridge in there just because he came to us on loan. Fantastic player, good lad, and uh, could, there's so many strikers we could put in there, but I put him in there just because I think he's. He's one of the best around at the moment. I'm pleased with that selection. I think we've uh, got a lot of quality. I think we'd be a contender for the title, I think.